Hey, what's going on, everyone? Today's August the 7th, uh, 2023. Here to talk about Filecoin today. I want to answer the question, why in the world is Filecoin continuing to go down? Now, when you think about a market, a market, you, you think about people buying and selling, and it's all about supply and demand. And once the supply begins to overpower the demand, price has no other way to go but to the downside. And that's what we're currently seeing into the market in Filecoin. The market did a fantastic move like in the beginning of February. And ever since that time, price has came back down. So it is losing that interest, that demand, that, that wantonness of people trying to come in and purchase this cryptocurrency. So we're going to talk about that today because I didn't do a price prediction in Filecoin in my last video, which was produced on the 20th of April. So here it is today. I mean, you guys can even tell now that price is trading below our area of support, which was around $4.80, maybe $5. And the market is slowly on that steep decline. The market is not giving us any indication of price bullishness right now. So we're still trending down. So our overall price prediction would have to be that the market is generally more weak than it is giving us strength as of this particular moment. And we're not going to be bullish until we see the market in Filecoin break these two lines here on the chart. Okay. It has to break these two lines off the chart and to the upside in order for us to be, to become more bullish into this cryptocurrency now let's zoom in here on the two-day chart because i want you all to also understand that this market is showing us that interest and demand is coming in around four dollars okay this is where the market buyers are currently supporting the price in filecoin so if i were to extend this line here you guys can see that filecoin may actually be traded within a trading channel which is not a negative thing it's actually a positive thing we just really need to see the buyers show up around four dollars to confirm this is really what's what is going on into the market okay so let's look at this on the weekly chart here it is on the last week right here you guys can see that the market price action and filecoin is not extremely weak it just seems like no one is is buying and selling in filecoin like this particular exchange here on binance no one is really coming in and participating as of this moment that's why the volume is so white the last two weeks Okay, here it is on the two weekly chart. And again, you guys can see here on the two weeks that the selling came in, I would say over the last month or so. Most of the trades that occurred into the market in Filecoin were people trying to sell out of their positions rather than them trying to come in. Okay. Here is Filecoin on the five day chart. And I think you guys can actually tell what we're talking about in terms of weakness right here. So take a look at this on the seven hour chart real quick in Filecoin. And again, the market doesn't look extremely bullish. These are the type of markets to where you just don't come in and, and try to sit and let the market just trade for the long term because there's no price action going on here into the market in Filecoin. The only way that people can make money in any market is for price to move. So when you just see a market doing this, yes, you can make money, but you have to increase your position size in order to accommodate the lack of price movement. Okay. So let's take a look at this on 330 minute chart. So again, I'm not all ecstatic, I mean, about the price action in Filecoin just yet. It would have been great if the market in Filecoin was able to hold this particular trend, though. Would have been fantastic. But it's not doing that. Instead, it's going the opposite direction. I will just tell each and every one of you to keep your eyes open on this $4 area into Filecoin in order for us to really see some strength coming to the market in Filecoin. Okay, so I am going to play, you know, just a little bit of weakness into the market in Filecoin as of this particular moment. Now, as time goes on and we continue to see lack of demand come through this particular market, then we will extend our weakness to the downside. All right. So let me go ahead and put this on the chart and we'll be through first target. Like I told you, it was already around four dollars, three ninety nine, three ninety eight, which is only four point zero three percent move. Second target is going to be around 381. So those are the only two targets we're going to place right now. 
for Filecoin because I really don't think this market is that weak. And we're going to hold some resistance around $4.50. I might go a little bit higher than that. So we'll just compensate the market in Filecoin that way. Okay, so that's it. Not too much, not too, you know, I'm not looking for a crash or a plummet, anything like that. But just in case you guys were wondering, okay, why is not the market in Filecoin going higher? Well, it's because people are not willing to buy it right now. Go ahead and give me your thoughts. Make sure you maintain the profitability. And as always, trade different.